Hi, today I'm spinning flax fiber into linen yarn. This is an old wheel. Um, when I say old, most flax wheels were, that are around today might be from the mid 17 to 1800s. The flax fiber I have wound onto my distaff, which is just a tree branch that is tied up and I pull down a few of the fibers at a time. The wheel does the twisting or the spinning and you can see the finished yarn is winding here on the spool. Linen yarn would have been used for um, making their linens. Ta Tablecloths, napkins, sheets, pillowcases, when it was woven with wool, using the linen as the warp for the strength and the wool for the warmth, they would have a material that was called Lindsay Woolsey. And that was common for petticoats or shirts to keep them warm in the winter time, but the wool was easier to dye with the natural dyes and would give them color in their clothing also. Girls learned to spin when they were five or six years old and were expected to have spun and woven a complete dowry before they got married, maybe when they were 16. The thickness of the yarn is controlled by the amount of fiber I pulled down and the water in the coconut shell uh, help smooth in the ends if you want to come cl closer to see just the yarn you can see if I spun dry all those hair like fibers sticking out where wetting it helps them cling together so that more of them get twisted in And there is the finished yarn.